So what you like, yeah, nice. And I'm going to do it remotely too. You don't even have to go somewhere to do the job, huh? You just need a stable internet connection and you can work. All right, it's uh, jump in. I know they have the Duskborn stuff in here. I feel like I should pick one of the monocolored here. But I'm very drawn to survival. I want to see it work. Even though I don't think it's really going to. Yeah, man, just stable internet connection, work from home. Oh, okay. I mean, I'm tempted to go revives here. I think that's it, where we're gonna go black, white, black, life revives. I'm not even gonna look, I'm just gonna click play. Our first opponent is Derpageddon. Great. Love it. Opening hand looks amazing. Tap land. Boo. I would murder that, but I can't. Get the 2-2 two, two Vigilance down. You mana ramped. Alright, that's fine. I'm, I'm not going to let that Twitching Doll live. There's no way. Bolt the bird is now Murder the Doll. You know, just... You gotta kill it as fast as possible. Murder. Um, do I want to offer the trade for a surveil? Yeah, I think I do. We want that. That's the whole point of the deck. Oh, you don't want to trade. I will trade. Mm, no, I don't want to trade. No blocks. Because you're not going to block my next attack either. Mr. Derpageddon. I'm going to unlock... This room here. Attack. We get our pump, our surveil. I want the land, yes. So I told you they weren't gonna block. Whenever you manifest dread, you mana ramp? That seems crazy. Ooh, 
No, you can get that damage in. That's fine. Yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. One of them in the hand, rest into my graveyard. Get my good free attack in. You probably finally want to trade. Nope. No. Well, I need the creature. Man, Simic is just really good in this set. <laughs> There's not even, like, a creature in my graveyard worth bringing back right now, which is awkward. I'll land short of that guy. Well, uh, I guess we draw. block there, but that's what I need to block. So expensive. Why didn't you do the thing? You could have you could have gotten the thing. Oh, there it is. Yeah, cool. We lose. 
We, we are too far behind for that bullshit. All right. <laughs> Midweek magic. I get to play one, two at least. We'll see if uh, three happens. Heck yes, we get to curve out. Honestly, I don't care what you kill. We're curving out. That is a race that we cannot win. But we can stop it, <laughs> if only temporarily. Has to be blocked. I will block it and I will kill it. Oh, I see what I did wrong there. Okay. Let's race. And then I've got this full activated. They're not going to like that next turn. They're about to discard their whole hand. Exiled rough. I was going to flip that next turn. Oh, uh, yeah, there goes your hand.
Let's race. My 6-5 versus your 3-2. Sure, your 4-3. I, th I think I still win this race. That much damage to any target. Wild. Um, just have a bunch of one ones. This, this doesn't help. This doesn't help. Grievous wound, so good. We're just gonna kill your creature. Okay, now what? Now you can't target him. You have to discard a card. You can't target him. <laughs> you needed to wait a turn for that. one when I curve out it kind of works I not even answering that one that one was not very fun opponent didn't understand ward ooh this is actually a really good card that's fun Right, I'll get through this ward someday. Like, all you had to do was save a card for a turn instead of casting it. And then you would discard the extra spell or whatever. Like, so what? You had to two for one it with the removal. It had a finality counter on it. It was, it was done. Oh, uh, this is so... So gonna get me in trouble. Go. I never didn't have it. The old dick twister.
I don't have anything that I really want to discard. I think this works. Keep the goat back as a blocker. But they're not gonna swing in. Okay. I will trade my goat for your 2 4. That's. Money! To kill it every time, what do you mean? Like, you just swing it at me. I don't care. Go ahead and gain your two extra life. I'm trading for that twister, man. Every time. do if I have one of my own? Ah, oh, that's so funny. So this is just a mirror match. Yep. Exercise rough. Um, man, we just need double black here. Like a swamp. And then a dick twister. I'm not attacking, we're just twisting. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. It's unfortunately not as good as my demon. felt really good actually and then now this is just gonna outvalue him until I win yeah but yours isn't turned on <laughs> mine's at least turned on I see. I'll just take the damage. That's fine. That's fine. Huh. 
How about that? Now yours is gone. Good game. <laughs> <laughs> At least it works. It just doesn't work against the Simic stuff. Simic's too good. <coughs> right? And it's even worse that I just like straight up took his. <laughs> just like, you don't need that. That's mine. Here we go with some rooms. Really? All right. Cool. I wanted to commune with evil here. I think I gotta redo this and hold up. So you didn't cycle that, huh? Can't play that. We're gonna play the two seven. I will board wipe you, my guy. <laughs> I ain't scared to do it. <laughs> Don't you even, don't you even do it, Arena. I can't believe you're going to make me manually tap that.
this is bad for me. All of it. Can we get a good body to reanimate, please? If I could steal your stuff, I would. Got blue controlled. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's playable. Come on, Staicho. Oh my god, they're not ready. Hi. <laughs> oh, man. Swamp cycle that, and we can instant speed revive it.
play your bat. And tap my creature on attack. Wait, what happened to your bat? Did you put it on the bottom? That's a lot of lands. So the thing with this card is you don't even have to do it out of the thing you milled so you can get back like your best creature. This say its name I think is going to be really strong for limited. It looks a lot better than it, it reads. Oh, and they've got the graveyard guy. Target creature from a graveyard to the battlefield. This one. Oh, it's the unholy annex for sure. Are you a demon? You're a spirit. Whatever, it's worth it. Worth. Ugh. so sick with it. <laughs> Man. Glad I didn't play the survival stuff. <laughs> you think that's the problem? If you would have got rid of the flying demon, that would have looked a lot better for them. I didn't mean to click out of that game. They could have gotten rid of the demon, and then my enchantment would have started pinging me for two damage every turn while I was drawing cards. I don't know why they did that. That was weird. Very, very weird. Um, claim my thing. There we go. Ooh! This card's going to be really, really good both in limited and I think in standard for a little bit. This thing's crazy. And getting the card style for it, that's awesome. That is awesome. All right, well, that was midweek magic. Let's go do some drafts. Let's see if we can get out of gold. Oh, man. Three, three haste when it's dealt damage, redirect it. Seems okay. Just a two, three flying. Not bad. There's the reanimator build. One plus one trample as long as more in the graveyard. Man, a four to three haste with delirium, huh? Crazy. 
I mean, it's the mythic or this uncommon, maybe murder, but I should probably take the mythic here. So we're going to pick up the red card, take a look at what comes around. <laughs> Enchanted creature gets one plus one for each enchantment you control and has first strike. That just is so good in this set with all the enchantments. Violent Urge has been pretty good with the Delirium too. Man, come on, just looking at Boros or what? Tap two and then tap creatures you control. It's a five four for three, but I gotta tap two creatures or two lands extra. Rough. Flying lifelink can't block when enchantment enters. Fully unlock a room. Man, I might try to do the Grixis thing. We got a good red. We'll pick up a good blue black uncommon. This thing seems really good. Like, I could even pivot for it good. 2 2 flying lifelink. Get it from your graveyard to your hand. Yeah, we're 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 doing some stuff. Can't be blocked. The source would deal damage. They mill. <laughs> uh, unlock all the rooms. Win the game. Three three flying unlocks doors. Seems pretty good. I wonder if this will come back around for me. Yeah, I think I want the door unlocker more than I want the rare. Though this thing does seem pretty fun. Yeah, they reprinted Ethereal Armor. I mean, it, the glimmer thing, you know, like it looks like a glimmer from the set and with all the enchantments from the rooms and things like that, like I can kind of see why they did that. Damn. It's not better than Dragon's Fire, though. I think I'm going to take the removal here in Dragon's Fire. Just another key bearer. Violent Urge. Maybe vanish from sight. I'm going to grab the key bearer though. These things are just great. Trial of the Agony has been a fun card. I'm not seeing any black cards, though, outside of the Fear of Infinity that I picked up. Stop damage, destroy it. Great. Uh, deal 2, gain 2 with what I'm trying to do isn't bad. Although I might want to pick up the Terramorphic Expanse while I have the opportunity, huh? I need to get some more enchantments and some more doors. You've been interesting, but I'm not building that deck today. Megalodon is just a good top end, and it's a mana fixer, so it's something that I'm going to be looking for. Surveyor makes an enchantment. There is a door. Yeah, all right, well, pack one's not gonna do anything for black for us, unfortunately. The 
for the memes. <laughs> for the memes. Yeah, Glimmer Burst fits the deck, though. All right, we need to pick up some bodies here. And the hand that feeds is decent. Uh, live or die is so good. And got Phantom is good too. So is the Bailmark Leech. Honestly, I might pick up the cheap creatures here. Because I don't see an enchantment path that I want. Although the Infernal Phantom deals damage to any target. Yeah, it's removal. I need to take that. I need to take that. This makes the two twos and gets something back. Yeah, this thing's so fun. Tanic the Thrice called. I feel like if you can get him early enough, like I have the option here, you can kind of go crazy. But he's just an uncommon, like he's not even a rare. So it is possible to, to pick a couple of those up. Oh man, there's my mana fixing. Fuck. No. No, I want the room first. We'll hope the land comes back. Oh, well, there's two, two in a row? Rough. All right, do I want the enchantment trigger or do I want the room trigger? I think we take the three, three flyer. Trample haste, and we cast it from your graveyard if a non-zombie creature died this turn. If you do, return it with the counter. With the Defiled Crypt, that can be kind of insane. I'm, I'm going to pick that up. <laughs> Excuse me? You may cast it from my graveyard if a non-zombie died? Okay. Okay. Sheltered by Ghosts is so good. I could have made a really good Boro stack. I plan for this one to flop. You know, like... I gotta experiment sometime. Armor comes back. Crazy. Crazy. Search for basic land, reveal it, sacrifice keys, unlock a door of target room. Okay, yeah, that that seems bad, but for what I'm trying to do, it's going to be great. Ah, oh, second fear. Yes. All right, we're not out of this just yet. Whenever enchantment enters, whenever we fully unlock a room, surveil. Thank you. And I might just take the doll here. Uh, the doll? No. I want the doors. Um, do I want a counter? Unblockable draw. You're an enchantment. I don't 
know that I want to play you in my deck. Meat Hook Massacre 2. Oh, man. That is just being greedy. That is just being greedy. I think I need the meat locker here. Meat locker is probably my best pick for my deck. Ah, uh, that's so rough to have to pass. There's no way it's coming back. There's no way. Um, I can do that one. It's not gonna happen. We could try to do the crab to mill a little bit. That could be kind of fun. Oh, no, nope. mana fixing. Need the mana fixing. Um, yeah, none of that works. None of it. We're going to take Fear of Lost Teeth, I think. Man, the Cursed Windbreaker. Yeah, Cursed Windbreaker. Another Meat Locker, all right. Or Keyblade, or Key Bearer, Keyblade. That's a different game, Well, Different game. Yeah, we'll take the fire here. Got a whole place out of the, the door bearers. That's kind of amazing. Uh, most valuable slayer. Glimmer Burst. Enigma. This is not uh, looking good over here. None of these cards look real good here at the end. Not for what we're doing. Alright. A little bit of a flyer will help out. Um, grab the prize maybe is playable. Alright, I got a lot of work to put this deck together all of a sudden. But there is some fun little things going on between some of the enchantments and the recursion. Do I really think that eight or more different named rooms... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have exactly eight. So I have to get all four of my rooms out and unlocked. I guess you're mana fixing, you're mana fixing, you're mana fixing. You're mana fixing. Alright, maybe I'm not as bad off as I thought. We got four pieces of mana fixing. That should 
be enough to make a three color deck work albeit not very well <laughs> not gonna lie um let's see here i want to take out out anything that's not a creature or removal i think for just a moment and kind of see what i have left uh, i'm gonna count this as a creature because it manifests dread when it enters so it is a 2-2 two -two flying for three when it enters which is not bad it just has upside after um, da, da, da. Honestly, I don't know that I'll need the Prowler in this deck. Uh, the rooms, 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 Ripper. Uh, type equals creature. What a wild creature curve. We've got three pieces of removal. That's it? Didn't, uh, I guess this is kind of removal. We didn't see any of the red rooms with like the glass works. Those would have been really good to see. And All right, that's out. <laughs> we probably won't need power two or less. That's a lot of my stuff, actually. Playmate might just be the all star. The only creature I really get back is the undead sprinter with the defiled crypt, although it does trigger itself once. Huh. What if we just cut black here? Oh, I shouldn't have gotten rid of all the swamps. I need at least one. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. the harrowing the intervention or the teeth at that point but infinity skull nap undead sprinter if we're gonna do the undead sprinter then i do want that just because Which gives me what three black sources for one two three four five Ugh. that's ten 
13, 14, 15. Sixteen, seventeen lands. Can probably cut one of the key bears. Leave it at the forty cards for splashing black. I don't have high hopes for this deck. I tried to force something stupid. I wanted the meme doors thing and it didn't come around. I should only do it if I get the five color chick in my pack one pick one. It was silly and uncalled for and I should not have done this draft. <laughs> yeah, punished. So I could play the keys, I could crack the keys, I could find my swamp, I could play it. I can't do anything else. So I guess I just do the same thing, Surveyor. Do you want to trade? Interesting. Alright, well we can next turn. Go keys. I want to play the flyer now so we crack with the mountain. Go find our swamp. We'll play swamp. We'll play the nuisance. Yeah. That's fine. Tap my flyer. I guess I just play the 4 4 flyer. Or the 3 3 flyer for 4.
Let me use this to sack this to kill this. Haha, <laughs> nice. Honestly, it just looks like I'm getting lucky and that I'm playing lands and my opponent is not. Okay. Boo, meat locker. We get to do it back. can't recast the zombie this turn, but that's fine. Let's unlock. Oh, that's dirty. matters especially if you think you can attack right now you're crazy <laughs> yeah you better keep that back three six Seven. I'm one land short of doing it all, huh? Okay. So it's not as bad as I thought. 
It's just going to be rough if we play against an aggro deck. Or a, a really good manifest deck. The good old cup game. Well, I mean, we get to play the Demir cards right away. Nuisance. Fear will trigger the Eerie and let me see, unless they kill it. Swing it! I would kill your monkey. You land? That is not a land. We're gonna bend that. We don't we don't need that right now. I can't block your monkey this time. You should have done it last turn. Fear of Infinity says I do not have to fear your monkey and anything it thinks it's capable of doing. Oh, this meat locker with this key bearer is so good. Oh, Fear of Infinity can go there. And then we attack with everything. And then we unlock the room. And we get Fear of Infinity back into our hand. And then we get to draw a bunch of cards. Um, no, we'll throw that in the graveyard. We don't need that. Yeah, we need that. Oh, I have to discard a card now. Um, well, crap. Yeah, I guess I'll discard a mountain. Play a mountain. Um, ah, no. You're just gonna kill the monkey. That's not worth it. End turn. <laughs> I mean, we have six flying damage and we're gaining two life a turn, so. Man, if this goes even three and three, I'll be happy. This is silly. Blow him up. I get to play this one and get the other one back. <laughs> um, yeah, you can keep one or the other. I probably should have done that next turn, but whatever. Man, Grixis, how does it work? I can't block it. It says I can't. There's like the second line on there. He can't block. Ooh, ooh. Okay, I see you. Okay, I see you. So 
Maximum is zero, that's fine. Megalodon. <laughs> Fear of infinity loops with itself. That's funny. I might build a standard deck out of that, actually. How? Let's see how you do this. I'm pretty sure I have lethal right now, but I want to make sure. Yeah, I'm sure there's some kind of soul tie something you can do with all the the milling in green. I shoot your face. I mean, they definitely put up a fight. <laughs> that was a game of magic, for sure. Hey, I love getting rares. But this, this should not be playing this well. <laughs> Even as somebody who was like, hey, there's probably a Grixis room deck. Like, I mean, Grixis is playing around with shit in this set for sure. But I got a feeling if we go against Boros or the Simic Manifest Dread, we're just going to get wrecked. We're not going to stand a chance. Wizard of five, Wizard of V, Wizard of five. I don't know. Uh, I see a curve of two, three, four unlock. Seems playable. Uh, we even got the black mana. We don't have to go looking for it. All right. Grixis on turn three. Here, I'm just going to cycle this. Make your decisions. Uh, 
Uh, that's pretty smart. Then he gets to... That's pretty cool. Haven't seen Gruel yet, but it's it's doing some things. It's definitely doing some things. just can't let you keep manifesting dread. I'm sorry. Why? Why did you have to have that? <laughs> oh yeah, we're done for. We are done for. Agro is pretty decent in this set, both in Gruul and in Boros. When you get the right cards, I guess, huh? Man, this looks good. Turn two Grixis, Piranha Fly. Turn three's nemesis. Ah, uh, piranha fly. This thing's crazy good. I'm gonna have to kill that like as soon as possible. This game is over. Fuck.
Boo. Yeah, and they just had the right cards at the right times. And we drew nothing but lands. Literally nothing but lands. The whole game. Every card we played was in our opening hand. The four cards we got were in our opening hand. We saw nothing else. Four cards and a bunch of lands. Oh, the limited beats. Class works. All right, you win. You win. You have the removal, I have nothing. So we went from Jessicai artifacts to Jessicai enchantments as a, a playable draft archetype. That's fun. CMC nerd. Nobody tell him it's mana value now. Turn into an island. I mean, this thing coming down on turn three every turn was pretty consistent. <laughs> Never mind. I think I want the ghostly key bearer out so we can try and get the crypt out next turn and unlock it and get, I don't know, maybe dagger maw back. Oh, never mind. I played the wrong creature and got it. That's always cool. That is always cool, I guess. Yes, give me delirium. <laughs> right, like I said, you get to about that three, you know, oh, you won two here, we're just gonna jam the good decks in front of you now, like, oh yes, right, 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 thank you. Mm. 
I can cast the thing there. I don't really want to do that there. I'd rather give you flying. Alright, if we can just get this defiled crypt onto the battlefield, you know, we might have a chance here. This guy's not manifesting as much as I thought he would. Actually, I think we take that out while we can. And that out while we can, that's fine. Go ahead, gain the life. You don't have the blocks. Take action. Oh, you don't want me unlocking that room. Oh, that doesn't matter to me at this point. With thanks. Looks like we're at least going to get the 3 of 3 with my failed deck attempt here. Although I don't want to speak too soon. Flying threats or things with reach. Yeah, good game. Good game. All right, well, that's three wins. Like I said, three and three, and I'm happy, so. Can't expect too much with what I've threw together here. I know a little bit is everybody's still figuring things out, but some of these cards do synergize. So this sucks just a little bit in that I really want to play Terramorphic Expanse on turn one and go get a red mana. But in doing so... I can't play anything else, so we're going to play Terramorphic Expanse on one and get a blue mana and hopes that the Meat Locker and the Key Bearer can get us to red. Ah oh, man, that's rough. I mean, we would just draw... A blue. All right. We still need to do it, though. Nope. We're going to Terramorphic for the other Swamp, I guess. 
After a swamp. There's gotta be blue or black to keep us on curve. Hey, there's red. Never didn't have it. Never didn't have it. What is this? Uh, that's gonna be annoying. Um, honestly, we don't need that. Play along. <laughs> You're supposed to use it to tap your own creature. So you get your surveil triggers. Oh, uh, you think I'm not gonna block that stupid thing? I'm tired of you gaining the life off of it. I'm tired of you gaining the life off of it. Um... A start for him. I know I said I was going to be happy going three and three, but having the curve like I had and just being interrupted into oblivion sucks. There's nothing I can do about it. Absolutely nothing I can do about it. Oh, graveyard. Graveyard! Oh, this one. Take action. Surveil, yeah, that's fine.
Omni Fresh, man, you have the advantage. You don't need to overthink it too much. Exiled, damn, Might be game. Yeah, I think this is game right here. Unnecessary. Yeah, I knew I was gonna draw a fucking land. Every time you need to draw something other than a land, it's always a goddamn land. Always. That little sheep, man. That that little sheep. Enduring innocence. Yep. They made the glimmer good. Holy crap, if you can play into them. Um, do we have dailies going? No, we did those already. Experience is gone. Uh, we're going to take a quick uh, bathroom, drink, smoke break, and then we will come back and do, I think, one more draft for today. And then call it an afternoon.
All right. Back at this format, trying to figure some things out. We know Manifesta is good. Rooms can be decent. I just finally got wrecked by a survivor deck. It's been the best one I've seen. All the other ones have been garbage. This 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 format's uh, kind of fun. Oh, well, I mean, if I just got beat by it, I might as well pick it up and play with it, right? Like, that's how this is going to work. So, pack one, pick one, the fucking innocence that just wrecked me. And now we got to decide. Oh, there, there's a glass works. That's amazing. Attacking creatures get the buff. I mean, we could, we could just do the Boros. The Boros nonsense. Do I want the buff or do I want the, the Glassworks removal? Like go, I could pick exercise too and we could wait to see if we're gonna be more green or more red depending on what's flowing. Lands you control have add one mana of any color. Oh, we could just go five color, five color bullshit. That's kind of funny, actually. All right, Exercise is the better card here. It costs less, and it hits way more things. And it doesn't force me into Boros just yet. It keeps me open. Search my library for a demon. Put it in my hand. Shuffle. Four more cards. Put that. I'm going to search for any card. So, two mana search for a demon, but if I have delirium, I can search for anything. It is demonic tutor. Cool. Um, we could do enchantment stuff. I could just pick up the white removal here. Ticket booth is okay. I like piggy bank better if we're going to be looking at Boros. Uh, we'll have to see. I mean, red's been pretty okay. We're we're in Boros. Sorry, I'm not letting that go by. There's no way. You guys are crazy. Instant or sorcery. Put a time counter. No twenty damage to you. Whoa. Interesting. That's not ever really gonna kill me in limited. But that doubles up your removal. That's pretty fun. I'm, I'm going to take the doll, though. Twins is going to be pretty good because it's two, two, twos for four in our deck. Monkey would be great. Yeah, we're, we're confirming doll. We're, we're Boros. All right, Monkey. Thank you. I, I could take Vicious Clown here, too. He does seem pretty, pretty awesome. But Monkey is just on the low curve spectrum where we want it to be. The hexproof is nice, but I'm gonna try and get as many monkeys as we can. Make a bunch of one ones when the store put them. Yeah, this is good for our deck. This is a trap in limited. Man. Okay, confirm. We just gotta hope that we didn't send red so hard that the person to my left doesn't want to give me any red on the way back. I think jump scare is better than the clown here. Uh, da -da -da -da, tap to exile target graveyard. Three or more cards. It gets and this hex proof. That seems pretty legit. I'm willing to give that a shot. Get out of here, jump scare. Ah, uh, this card was too fun. Uh, I can't wait to draft more of those. Um, I mean, if we're playing anything, it's this one. But I don't even know that I'm going to play it. That uh, does meet the requirement of the two or less for the, the drawing the card. Oh man, come on. You two were meant for each other. Yes. Uh, we want the doll. 
Give me all the toy dolls. The twins wield. Thank you. That's amazing. I mean, you're maybe played as a high top end in our deck. You're just gone. How is this the last pick? Really? That thing's so good. Don't need that. I feel like this is counterintuitive to what I want to be doing. Like, the front half is good to get the mana value thing back, but the putting counters on stuff starts taking away some of my things. Although, I guess it just really takes away from the doll, doesn't it? So, this is probably really good for our deck. Dragonfire is really great. Glassworks is really great. I want to pick up the Dragonfire because it's cheaper. And I don't expect to see red, so we'll see what happens. I sent some really strong red signals to my opponent. Wayline of Hope. As long as I have at least seven more life than the starting life total, creatures I control get plus two, plus two. I mean, I do gain a little bit of life there. If I can start buffing. I don't see anything else that I really want. Another ley line of hope. Okay. Um, I mean, I really kind of want like the cheerleader or the twins here, I think, more. Twins is already wheeled once. So we're going to take the cheerleader and hope. I guess either ley line of hope or twins wheels again. Uh, the mind skinner. Oh, well, there's a monkey. I think I'm going to take the monkey over the goat. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Although the rotunda... Trapped in the screen is removal. I should pick up some removal. Man. Yeah, I'm gonna take the removal. Monkey or Rotunda will will wheel. Having two of those would have been sick though. Ooh, a glassworks. Fuck yes. Duck loves that. Uh, we're gonna try this guy out. Getting two of them seems a good way to do that. Um escort. Razor, oh no, the Slayer. The Slayer is so good. Goat made it around. This thing, even if I don't pump it, I think I want. It's a body that is removal. Oh, another Glassworks. Thank you, guys. It's like you don't want to be playing in one of the best friggin' archetypes in the format. Um, googly eye spider for S's and G's. I'm not playing anything I'm picking anyway. Oh, googly eye spider. <laughs> That's actually a really good payoff if you're in the, uh, the green black delirium deck there. Ooh, see, I told you one of the two would wheel with the twins. So we don't really want to be playing the ley line. Yeah. Get that out of there. Although, if I do splash blue, tunnel surveyors, man, those would be insane trigger in my two or less. That might actually be a removal that we play. It's not the best, but it does kill stuff. Undead sprinter, sorry, you don't get to play. Mana fixing could be interesting here. Pyroclasm. Beginning your second main phase. If it's tapped, draw a card. If I control a glimmer. If I don't control a glimmer, create a glimmer. Ooh. I 
might try this out. We'll try the Glimmer guy out. The Pyroclasm is good. The mana fixing is good. But I haven't even seen this. Switching doll. Sorry, but not sorry. We're definitely going to be taking this. Ethereal armor. Phantom's decent, but I don't think it's going to quite make it. Oh man, this thing is actually worth splashing. Like, 100% worth splashing for. Although we have a Glassworks as an option, or another valuable Slayer. I've already got two Glassworks. Do I really need a third? We're already at 14 creatures, so we don't really need to be picking too many more creatures up. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to take the Slayer. I'm going to take the Slayer. We, we, we don't need the more removal. We've got enough. <laughs> Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So something will wheel. Yeah, we're going to take the Sheltered by the Ghosts and hope the Twins wheel again. Uh, there's a Slayer. I should have taken the Glassworks. Boo! Oh, well. Um, honestly, I think we're taking the Goat. This thing's pretty cool too, but I'm nowhere near it. Although if I would have picked up that other green manifest card and that as a splash, that could have been really fun. An ethereal armor or a one-time? I think we take the one-time here, actually. Um... We're not playing anything we pick, so let's pick this one. We don't need the bear trap. Honestly, I probably want, might not even need the goat. Oh, hey, the land came back. Fuck yes. Um, actually, I want to take the uncommon. Okay. Uh, this completes the set. Completes the set. Heck yes. All right. Well. Starting to hit that point on these uh, commons and draft where I'm completing things I'm not even playing. That's that's always nice in a set. All right, we gotta thin this just just a little bit. We're gonna just take these out for now. Glassworks are a three drop. Ugh, so we don't want you. You are a two drop. Crazy. All right. We're going to look. Uh, type equals creature. Get that down. Cool. I think everything I got except for the one creature is power two or less yeah that's amazing how many did we get we got 16 16 and 8 puts me at 24 with 16 lands like that's that's a sweet spot i just gotta decide what eight i want
I guess this makes creatures. So I could cut the goat. We got three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I need to make what two cuts here? Phantom wants the enchantments. Scorching dragon fire is just so good. And it might be violent urge. An unwanted remake. I don't think there's a reason to give them a 2 2 for removing their thing. This is removal, 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 removal. So that's five full pieces of removal, and then I just got three good buffs. One of which makes creatures. Okay. Uh, my lands. Unsuggest. I think you're wrong. Because you missed one. Is there anything up here I can justify having in red and white over a land? I think the curve is low enough. Where are we at? Uh, it's a 3.2. That's a little high. So maybe I don't want to cut. Maybe I do want to keep it at the 17. All right, we'll, we'll roll it and click play. <laughs> Looks good. Yeah, I think it's worth it. I'm gonna kill your gremlin. I'll give my cheerleader flying. I have no fear of Loft's teeth. set up infernal I want to put the doll down and then I want to play the twins and attack with the doll I think kind of set up a combo turn <laughs> okay I'm not killing that fear of lost teeth with my 2-2 that's silly I know it deals the damage to anything.
Leave my ghost doll alone. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. That's pretty good, actually. Uh, damn it. That would have been really good, too. Attacks. That's that's not worth it. Boo. Nah, you can hit me with that. That's fine. Oh, come on. We can't peter out like this. Oh, what? I gotta update the system. They're gonna <laughs> kick me out in 10 minutes if I haven't done it. Yeah, that's a good combo you got going. I can't do anything about it. I mean, that, that doesn't really help me. Five four flying discard cards just be a dick. Just trying to buy time. <laughs> We're not doing it very well. Yeah, murder my church leader. Double up. Um, glass works and get rid of this. looking bleak but we're not we're not out oh no we, we just died all right that's that's unfortunate we just died because we can't exile these guys and if we kill them they just kill us oh there's the yard boom Boros beat the Byrakbos. 
Alright. Oh, no, 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 no. Cancel, 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 cancel. I need to go do a system update for this. I will do that real quick. Hey, can you update? Are you telling me mine was up to date and I didn't have to do that? I got a warning message and got all scared for no reason. I guess we'll see if it kicks me out. But I did not see any update that I needed to do. I mean, it's not the best, but it is cheerleader, removal, flying cheerleader, valuable slayer. don't need any more lands. That's, that's enough arena. Give me the cards. Oh, the hand out feeds. So I'll just trap you into my television. Slayer. Oh, this is so good. No. <laughs> ah, Boros. Bloomborough cards. I thought we were done with that. Currently waiting because we kicked everyone out to update and now there's only five of you playing. <laughs> Pocky? That's delicious. Monkey.
Obviously, the doll. And that looks familiar. It's glassworks. Kill the big one. I offer you a trade. Oh wait, you can't block. That's right. It's uh, too many lands though, game. Fear of infinity with enchantment or equipment. Yeah, that's pretty good. That is pretty good. Wow, too many lands. Too many lands. Prevent three damage, please and thank you. Ooh. That could be bad for us. Uh, let's see, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. It costs five, it costs four. Play the Slayer this turn for the damage. Uh, is that the demon? Yeah, that's the demon. get that. Yeah. Yup, yup. You win. Okay, that card's good. It doesn't look like it, but it is. That is not healthy. Not at all. Hey, finally! We gotta do the thing. Unfortunately, Slayer's gotta go away because he messes up the curve.
Yeah, cheerleader. That's pretty sick, actually. Are you gonna exile it? The one thing? The one thing. Really? Fuck off. Dragons fire my friggin' glimmer. used it on the wrong thing because <laughs> why would you have more than one equipment in your limited deck that's, that's silly will that's silly I don't, don't think about it too, too hard. Uh... Too much life gain going on. That's it, we lose two for one. I exiled the wrong equipment. Give that death touch. Oh. Just every time it attacks manifest is so good.
just like that. Why do you have so many equipment in your deck, dude? <laughs> I mean, I'm losing to it, but still. <laughs> I don't know why you wouldn't swing like all out, but okay. Strike and death touch, that's smart. <sighs> I mean, that is not the play. Can't attack. Damn. Alright. I'm not waiting for you to click buttons. That was rough. That was rough. One and three again. Man, really gotta stop doing that. That one didn't count. <laughs> it was too fast. Man, that Boros deck looked really good. Well, maybe. We'll see. There's there's always, you know, eight people ready up and seven click the button. There we go. But yeah, dude, that, that one didn't count. Hey, Zimone. Girl, we can do it. This demon looks pretty sick too. Yeah, that's pretty good too. I think I'm going to take Zimone. We're going to pass on the doors. The doors haven't been treating me good. So, looking at this, only if he was cast does he do the thing. So, if you can reanimate him, he's a 6 6 flying that draws an extra card. But only if he's cast does he doom everybody with the six. So he's a very strong reanimator target. Very strong reanimator target. Hmm. 
and then immediately get no green or good good green or blue cards it's like saved by ghosts or slayer is the best in the pack i mean we might be able to do the nuisance a little bit yeah none of that looks good none of that looks good oh then there's the reanimator spell for the demon the next pack that's funny Somebody's going to do it. It's not me. Uh, Monstrous Emergence is removal. That's great. We've just seen how good that guy can be. Oh, Stay Hidden, Stay Silent is also removal. Removes abilities. We might take that over the green card. Keep us in Zimone's colors. There's a lot of good blue cards here, though. We could try to cut off green. Yeah, I might try to corner green, actually. Yeah, we could add two of the dolls already. Three one one counters on up to one target land you control. Start turning my lands into three threes, huh? I mean, we could go for a Soul Tide Delirium deck. I have seen that kind of work. That's a good removal spell. There's mana fixing. That's mana fixing. And honestly, it's the land here, isn't it? Like, nothing else is gonna put us where we need to be. Discard your hand, draw X cards, where X is the number of card types among cards in your graveyard. That's probably a really fun build around. That's gonna be really good for uh, Pioneer and Standard, I bet. We're going to take the land. Take the land. The Terramorphic Expanse. Guarantee our ability to open up. Oh, I can just take this one too. Yeah, we'll see where we go with the green black. Let's, let's try the Soul Tie. Let's try it. Let's try it. Uh. I mean, it's the only thing in the colors I want to be in, so it's what I'm picking. Hey, the Miasma Demon came back too. I'm going to take the 5 4 flyer discard kill things. We've got our top end and some demons. That's sick. It's just getting ready to eat that glimmer. Uh, 
cast an enchantment, unlock a door. I'm not really doing either of those right now, so... That is not an option for us. Hell yeah, I will take that all day. <laughs> Leyline of the Void, it's pretty cool uh, art for that. There's another Vile Mutator for us to pick up. Um, oh, Mana of Any Color is good. Bookworm is great. Break Down the Door is amazing. I think because I'm trying to put a three pile or a three color pile together. I'm going to take the mana fixer elf here. Otherwise, I probably should be taking the bookworm here and just going manifest. Like, manifest dread. Uh, I'm going to turn permanence face up. Yeah, this guy's not coming back. Unstoppable Slasher, hell yes. I wish the mana dork wheels. I doubt it does. Huh? Go for the Delirium on the one drop there. That's pretty good. Whenever I manifest Dread, it comes to my hand instead. The Maglanoth. I don't have any like reanimation or anything like that yet. Meat Locker's been good. I really like playing the Meat Locker. This might push me a little bit more into Manifest Dread, though. I need to pick something that I'm doing. Yeah, let's play in with the Graveyard. Manifest Dread. This thing seems crazy. Fear of Lost Teeth. Whenever face down permanent control enters, and whenever it or another permanent control is turned face up, put a 1 1 counter on it. Oh, yeah, okay. That's what I'm looking for. Fear the dark has been pretty fun. Oh, no, this guy right here, the little doggo. This two drop is amazing. Uh, manifest to my hands. Manifix manifest. No, I want the two drop. I want the two drop. There's another dog. Man, that's a tough decision. I think I take this. The two three that pumps on manifest. Yeah, we're gonna do the pump on manifest and go manifest dread. We might be cutting the uh, the black cards here, still splashing for the removal. That's playable too. We're not. Uh, there's the demon ritual chamber, and we have demons aplenty. And the brood spinner is pretty good too. The fungus is amazing. I do think I'm supposed to take this rare though. 
I'm gonna look at putting my uh, really good black demons back in here. Silly. Alright, Soul Tide Demons. Hey, we got a reanimation spell. That's amazing. The doggo is probably going to wheel for us. That'd be pretty cool. Whenever a creature can die, each opponent loses a life again. Whenever I unlock the store, return all creature cards from my graveyard to the battlefield. I mean, this is just. What? Okay, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. We're gonna see where that takes me. That seems like cheating, honestly, but uh, who am I to decide? Uh, I mean, I kind of want to get stuff that mills now, right? Like, this is pack three. We're not going to see a whole lot of extra stuff at this point. Surveil's good. Pick up another demon. Yeah, I'll pick up a demon. It lets me discard for removal. Uh, we could turn everything into a demon and make sure that the one room is always turned on. That's pretty cool. I do like the killer's mask, giving something menace. Um, just manifest dread straight up. That's pretty good. Slim pickings now. I mean, Crack Skull's okay. I'd rather not play it. Uh, say its name's gonna be good for our deck, even if we only get the one. Oh, we got two of them. Fuck yeah. Fuck yes. <laughs> I, I I shifted it here. I, I think we're going to be base Golgari splashing for Zamone potentially we'll have to see because honestly if I just take all that out and we look at this we only have 13 creatures well that's not good Type equals creature. Uh, no, that's not right. Type equals creature. Now there we go. That's better. Whenever we manifest, you only manifest if we're tapped. You surveil. You're mana fixing. You manifest. You fight. You mill and grab. You manifest. Uh, 
That's just good removal. That plays with the graveyard a little bit, but the only thing that really does that is itself and the return all creatures from my graveyard. Man, we do have to go three colors just because those are where my bodies are, huh? Okay. But uh, type equals creature that solves one problem. Now I gotta figure out, like we really want this. This one's gonna be so good in our deck. The crypt might be cut. We're not really doing a whole lot with bouncing the graveyard, getting things back. Although I guess I do have a couple of say its name. And anytime I try to manifest with him out, he puts it into my graveyard and then puts it into my hand. Okay, I'll do pet dinner after this draft. Thank you for the heads up. Drive safe. Interesting. So this isn't looking as bad as I originally thought, huh? Let's get that in there. Dogs are good. Say its name is good. I don't know if the zealot is going to be worth it. Oddly enough. three return a creature or a land from a graveyard your hand we don't even have the three or more to do the the guy but it's fine and what do I cut here Can't really be my creatures. We need them. But Manifest Dread counts as a creature. Manifest Dread counts as a creature. Makes a demon counts as a creature. So I actually have three more creatures than what my creature count suggests. Which means we can cut the Piranha Fly. And honestly, I'm probably going to get rid of these two guys. Why does that feel weird? Can't attack or block unless I have delirium. But no, those are too good. I can't cut those. What am I talking about? Yeah, the Defiled Crypt with Paranormal Analyst. I think is going to be really good. Man, it is. It feels like it's like 
I don't want to say the zealot. He's there for the demons. Like, is the dog? That doesn't feel right. But the more I look, the more I think it's him. Ooh, that's rough. Are those my only two pieces of removal? No, because I also got the fight a thing, right? Where's the fight a thing at? Monstrous emergence. So I have three pieces of removal. That is it, huh? I mean, shit, looking at the deck like that, I should cut these guys, even though it combos with the what. And just run this? No, the Defiled Crypt is gone. I only want Defiled Crypt if I have the Analysts. I think we only manifest Dread so many ways. Oh, I thought that was the meat locker. This is a completely different room card. So bounce a creature, and then whenever one or more creatures are controlled to combat damage to a player, draw a card. That's pretty good. Yeah, no, we're gonna we're gonna play the Golgari Demon Splash Zamone. I, I feel this is the best I got right now. You would. That's fine. This is good. This is good. Um, we'll play the watchdog. Uh, I kind of like that there, actually. Thank you. This guy. So when we manifest here, we actually get the value there. My dog is a swamp. Yeah, I'll take it. I like lands. turn we can flip zealot play zamone if we get a land it'll trigger a 5-5 five, five primo
Man, it's like it hears me or something. That's sick. Oh, I don't have enough to play her now. Damn it. Alright, well, we'll play the slasher. Oh, I guess he goes with that other door too, huh? Man, maybe I do want that room in here. Does nothing now, but the next land I play is a 7 7. Uh, fear of the dark, that's fine. Oh, there's a 7 7 land. Let's put it on. No, that was dumb. I should put it just over here and leave it. That's fine. No attacks. End turn. Make a 7-7. Seven, seven. Unstoppable slasher with this is gonna be silly. Just making those little two twos. No, my room. <laughs> Did they forget the block primo? Oops. Yeah, because they were at six, they didn't even try to block primo. Now that we've seen it go just a little bit, we do have an interest in 
Oh, is it? It's in here then, huh? Oh. The defiled crypt. Oh, honestly, after seeing it, I don't think I need. The 3 3 beastie, whatever, feeding the graveyard. That was playing just fine with our two drops. Matter of fact, I might cut another one for that just to see if that does work the way I think it does. Just to see, you know? Yeah, I'm thinking they forgot the block too. Like, they were so focused on the menace guy. Like, ah, whatever, you know? But, like, yeah. They might have also realized if they did block in order to try and kill the, the Primo that their board state would just be so empty it wouldn't matter. Oh. We don't get that, but we get the dog and the inspector, and we hope that we don't get a whole bunch of more land. Uh, surveil. I mean, I can't cast her, but I do want her. Desperate, dude. Kill it. Set me up. Mm. Alright, make me feel bad about my decision. Cast it next turn. Oh, and I'm definitely killing the orphans. Definitely killing the orphans. Oh, my miasma demon. I don't know if that was right, but that's what we're doing. Another orphans, goddamn. You should have waited to orphans the cheerleader and then you would have gotten flying. What? I see, I see, I see. Okay. Well, 
That's unfortunate for me that I still have not gotten blue mana. Just gonna do the thing again. Damn, like obliterated this game. We were not even playing the same game. <laughs> oh, fuck. You, well, yeah, yeah, I, I'm gonna kill the orphans. Absolutely. The orphans are scary as fuck if they get going. You're... playing a joke on me. That's a good card. I should keep that. Oh, only certain ones, man. Only certain ones. Oh, you don't want to do the trade? I would have done the trade. We should have done the trade. and I'm willing to trade, that's fine. Huh? That's pretty cool. Do you want to trade any of them for my dog? Well, then I feel like I'm supposed to kill that one. Uh, we have blue mana already. Nobody's really that close. Yeah, graveyard. We want to draw. We want to draw something. from doing the thing, of course. Nice. Well, this might be another quick draft. <clears throat>
right. Unfortunately, we can't kill anything. I think we die. Oh, <laughs> they think so too. Happened. That first game was so good. He'll let me back into the lower area and play some of these noobs who don't know how to put a draft deck together. Like myself. Please kill it. Thank you. Thank you. the mutator I think I just want the land don't I no the land doesn't matter we already have the ritual chamber Another land as it is anyway. Uh, like a 6 6 demon. <laughs> Here we go. It's fine. <laughs> I literally have another demon in my hand. Honestly, I don't know that I'm going to discard anything for it. We're just going to cast it. have something to exile it. My god. One of us 
Gus is gonna run out of something to do eventually. Well, that sucks. We activate it, I'm gonna unlock it. We're gonna get crazy. looking to do with this stack. Oh, you for sure. Uh, yeah, I'm turning. Lockers. I turn my doggo face up. do it all we want there's no demon in my graveyard there's nothing in my graveyard all right well then you get obliterated by you And we're gonna turn you face up. Oh no, that was the wrong one. I wanted to turn that one face up. Well, uh, I guess we destroy you. Woo! I mean, we still got there. <laughs> even with the misplays, even with the misplays. The Sultai Demons have a have a chance here. There, there's some synergy in this deck for sure. I mean, we're gonna keep this just because we can say its name on two in order to get our third mana. I mean, we don't need to, but... FOMO, huh? I 
mean, we can't really let that happen. So we'll target you, and I'll show you I got this badass demon. Oh my god, what? Alright. Now we're just all cheating and magic. Got it. Enduring courage, huh? That's kind of insane, actually. surveilling another miasma demon huh uh, we put you into the grave class works who do you kill They'll come back. Got you. Got you. Swing. Swing. Do it. You know you want to. Oh, he's going to board wipe me. Just bring back the slasher. Kill it for good. <laughs> uh, not this time. Pyroclasm. Do it. Oh, you're thinking about it. You're thinking about it. You have to kill the demon or the room or that's game over. The demon hits you for six, the room kills you, yep. Man, I was sweating there a little bit. But it seems to be the uh, the streak right now. While everybody's figuring out is three and three. If I can break the three wins, that would be nice. I would like to get like four or five, get some of those gems back for that.
one and three and the O and three I've had. We need some good runs. Some good runs. enough of you. You can stay. Me too. Opponent, would you believe me if I told you we were the same colors and I'm not actually mono green? <laughs> Would you believe me, opponent? Because I wouldn't believe me. Kill it again. What else did we get in there? Manifest Dread, Vile Manipulator. We'll have to see how this goes. You actually got the stupid bug. That's clever, actually, because now it can be a tapped copy of that. That's nice. I'm going to remember that for the next time I get the, the Silent Hall Creeper. You want to pair him up with some surveil garbage. That's fine. Yeah, like pretty much the same deck. You just got a couple of better things than I did. You think I won't, dude? You think I won't?
Ah. I mean, I need the creature. All right, that goes to my hand. Oh, it's so good. It goes to my hand. <laughs> How can I forget? Well, that's fine, I think. Value back and forth here. Oh, I'm in trouble. I mean, there's no way they fall for it twice. But I have to try. <laughs> All right. A stick twister. I mean, that gives us an interesting line for sure. It doesn't do damage though, so what do I care? They've got Dick Twist online, so this is going to start to hurt. Oh man, can I get out of this?
play Zimone, but that doesn't help me. So I think we're going to actually drop the demon. And I would discard. And we'll kill the dick twist. All right, you've got a 5-5 five, five now. I gotta remember the 5-5. Five, five. All right, well, we're up in the flying. Our creature's dying, drain, and gain, so we're in a good position. We're gonna have to attack here soon. Oh my god, we're in a very bad position. Yeah, the Manifest Dread might be my favorite mechanic from this set. It's just so good. Dude, how many cards do you have left? You have two cards left. We want to unlock now. Uh, graveyard. Yeah, I think they realized. Hey, it's a positive. We are now four and two. It's a positive deck. Why are you giving me these? I have as many of those as I'm ever gonna need, Arena. That was a really close game. That was a very, very close game. But yeah, I think that would have been too much between like the Zamone, the dogs hitting. I would have gotten a Primo because I had just played a seventh land. Like, there was going to be a lot for them to fight through, and they only had two cards to draw. Man. <laughs> Man, that was close. I mean, we're going to keep this. This is super good. Full soul tie, have a dog. Take a peek. Uh, say its name is fine. is not what we wanted. Not at all. I 
mean, I'll trade f for sure. I wasn't sure that you wanted to trade that spider for my dog, so I didn't offer Hey, I wanted to swamp. So I didn't offer it up, but if you if you want to trade, then I'm okay trading. How does this look like? We go forest. Crypt. The next turn is a 6-6 six, six demon followed by a 5-4 demon. Hope they don't have something for my demon. Oh, that's fine. Um. Up to that many target creatures each. Getting rid of a land to do that is fine. Let's race. Turn and make a token. Could do the thing to start draining and gaining. Yeah, let's let's unlock the drain and gain. We'll manifest dread. And that's fine. We'll unlock and get back the demon that they killed. Attack for six. Right is a very unique, <laughs> very unique name indeed. But they are in do or die mode now. Do the thing? No, because it requires tapping. I said let's race and this guy said bet.
Dang. Well, I'm glad I'm not losing to that. <laughs> Oh man, if we could win one more and rank out of gold. That'd be pretty cool. You think you can make that happen, Arena? You can give me another deck that I can soul tie into the ground? Man of War. And that looks pretty doable. It's not the best, but it is playable. Draw a dog off the top. No, no dog. All right. Gremlins. Boo. Definitely do not want to be taking that much damage this turn. Um, we can go crypts and room. If auto tapper wasn't retarded, why do you do that, auto tapper? Why? Why do you insist on setting up me on failing with the only play I have? Literally the only play we can make is unlocking that door and you're gonna mess that up Ah, oh, that's so bad Man, Gruel Beats is strong. Can I stabilize? That's not really what we wanted. Don't worry about it.
Yes, blow it up. You definitely don't want me doing that. a tough way to go but it's, it's how we're going dang now I need to win two more games to rank up <laughs> we're dead I did not have fun, but thanks for asking me. All right, that's that. I think we're we're gonna call it the drafts. At least this one was was positive. The five and three is nice. The soul tie stuff, the gruel stuff looks really fun. Let's see what else we got. Bearing tenacity is kind of cool. Hey, I got the ley line of residence. And this thing is uh, making mono red win on turn two right now in standard. So that's fun. Thank you, sir. It's nice hanging out. I appreciate it. We're gonna go try and chop this footage now and post some uh, YouTube vids. Um, potential for a stream tomorrow if we do one I don't know if it'll be Bellatro or Magic Draft we'll see what I'm in the mood for uh, yeah turn two because you start with the lane line residence out on the battlefield um, and it says whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell that targets a single creature you control a copy of that spell um, and then you play the the mouse or the fucking here I'll see we'll go dex you play, where is it? It's, it's the, the girl shot. So all you need is a Heartfire Hero or a Cacophony Scamp. Um, you get the Ley Line. There we'll go. I'll, I'll set it up. Ley Line. Uh, Ley Line is spelled with an E, Will. E, E. Leyline. So Leyline of Resonance. Um, and then you need the Cell Sword. And you need either Monstrous Rage or they do the, the what is it, the turn inside out. Turn. Come on, where is it, stupid thing? I'll turn inside out. So because it does the plus three on it, the turn inside out will give you plus six, right? So you turn zero this out onto the battlefield. Turn one, you want either the Heart Fire or the Cacophony Scamp, and then turn two, you target one of them with these, and they'll pump themselves to about seven or eight damage and hit for seven, and then you fling for the other 14 or whatever. Sometimes you can get it to eight and you hit for 24, but you, you need all of those cards to appear in your opening hand with two mountains. That's it. That's all you need is two mountains. 
So like a lot of this is outdated. I need to go through and change the deck. But yeah, Leyline of Residence, because it copies. You just you pump the scamp to seven, the Heartfire Hero will pump itself to eight. And then you fling the rest, and since their ability makes them deal damage equal to their power to the target, like they die. <laughs> You know, like there's there's no stopping it. You have to have a turn one removal if you see Leyline of the Resonance on the the battlefield against Mono Red. If you don't, you're you're basically dead on turn two. So, yeah, this thing's silly. Yeah, discard changes. We don't need that. We don't need that. Oh man, it feels bad leaving three wins away. That's all right. We don't need them all. We'll get some tomorrow. All right, guys. Like I said, maybe Belotra tomorrow. Maybe Magic Draft. I haven't decided. We'll see what's going on. <laughs> yeah. We'll just turn two mono Red Bull. That's that's great. You too, man. Take it easy.